Hi everyone, this is a thrift shop haul. These are from two different uh, thrift shops. So the first one is um, a new one uh, for me anyway. I think it's it's like in the same town as the big one that I go to, but it's on the other side of it. Um, so I got this giant Hello Kitty. And it says I Apple New York, so I heart New York. And it has like a an American flag hair bow, and it was two ninety five. I'm sure it must have been like a lot more originally. <laughs> and that is the only thing I ended up with at that store because I found almost the entire um, like Shadow Hunters series. Um, and their paperback book said buy one get one free and they were like a dollar ninety five, so it'd been two for a dollar ninety five. Um but when I asked the lady in the book area she said, No, it's just this one little shelf and then when I got to the register it was actually all the books. So just Hello Kitty for that one. And then the other one was called Finders Keepers and it was like a two level place in the bottom with like booths that people could have, so a couple had clothing, one had jewelry, one was like a, almost like a beauty store, like they had all like shampoos and hair treatments and some perfume oils and all that stuff, and then upstairs was like, um, DVDs, CDs, VHS, and all like knickknacks, like, uh, collectibles. So the DVDs were 10 for $10 or just a dollar a piece. So I got four. I got um, Hatebreed Live Dominance, which is a live uh, Hatebreed concert. And it was filmed in Detroit in 2008. I was really surprised to find it there. Um, and hoping it actually plays well. Um, I've seen them live like quite a few times. I think the biggest one was probably at Oz Fest in 2007. I saw them at uh, Mayhem, I think, and one other one. Um, but they play pretty often in Connecticut because they're from New Haven. Um, and then I got Final Destination 2, You Can't Cheat Death Twice, and I got Holograph 1, and the smoke behind them makes a skull. And it's an Infinifilm one, which is neat. Um, I actually had this one when I was in high school. And it has all kinds of extras, um, like beyond the movie features, uh, with facts and like a terror gauge, um, deleted and alternate scenes, trailers, um, a commentary, how they did the deaths in the movie. And then it points out, like, the pattern of signs to look for in a movie. I thought that part kind of ruined it, so, um, if you actually like the movie and don't want it to be super obvious, skip that part. And then I got Final Destination 3, the two discs real ride edition, the super scary ride, and this one is where they're going to go on a roller coaster, and they get off of it. It has Ryan Merriman and, um... Mary Elizabeth Winstead. And then I got Titanic, the definitive documentary collection, the 100th anniversary of the RMS Titanic, so it's from 2012. And has four different things, and then a documentary about the Titanic survivors. I've been really, really interested in basically anything Titanic since I was in, like, fourth grade. <laughs> So a really long time. Um, I've read like a ton of books about it and watched like you know the Leonardo DiCaprio movie, but like documentaries about it. And I actually haven't seen this one yet, so I think that'll be really good. And then I got another Coca-Cola bear for a dollar. So it has a little Coca-Cola pin and then Coca-Cola tag. It says it's from '93, so it's quite old. Um, it was sealed until I accidentally ripped it open. 
I thought he was cute and could go with all my other polar bear and cold bear collectibles. So that is what I got at the thrift shop today. If you've seen any of the movies and like them, uh, comment below and let me know and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And uh, thank you for watching.